Hi guys, I'm gonna be getting ready this morning, but I wanted to talk about some updates in Project Pan and also I'm gonna use my Project Pan actually for the last time of the one that was that's for spring, like to spring, and then I'm gonna talk about um, some updates and everything on my channel. First of all, I wanna do a Q&A and I would love for you guys to leave questions down in the comments, whether it's about Project Pan, anything. Okay, anything. This is the Project Pan. And some of these are lip products and stuff that I've added in here, but basically this is my Sephora and I have to film the finale. I do have an updated skincare routine and there are a couple of videos that I plan to push out for you guys. Some of you all know that I do get a little bit of itty bitty 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 like um, I get some PR from brands, not as much as, you know, other YouTubers, but it's, you know, I, I, I like the brands that are sending me items. Um, a lot of times if I don't like it, let me put my hairband on. So my face is clean. We're gonna go into the brand, the skincare system that I'm using. And I am a total advocate of skincare systems. And I'm gonna talk about that in another video. I have so many ideas that I wanna bring. These right here. And this is a toner but you can use it kind of like I use it as a like almost you know how an essence makes things sink into the skin I feel like that this is what that is I do have a skincare routine and you guys have been talking about my glowing skin so I was like well let me talk about it I've been a fan for L'Occitane for a while so um, I, I have some of their products uh, I am gonna be coming with some more um, because I'm an advocate. I actually fell in love with them first with their body products, their shower oil, their, they have a body oil that I just tried this last Christmas and I love it. I am one about skincare systems and I am about a hygiene routine or self care. I like the self care because it takes it up a notch in terms of hygiene because hygiene is like oh I don't want to smell funky I don't want to smell but self-care is like I am taking the time to relax and like have this moment you know what I mean hygiene is like ooh, okay let's wash the body three cycles three cycles three cycles you know Sometimes I use this, you know, the trick that I have with this, I should have did it before I put on my eye cream, but if you use the oil, you know, of course don't get it in your eyes, but I kind of like pat it into the skin, but I would take it and pat it under my eyes and you, I, I'm telling you, especially at night, if you do that and you put it on, two oils really do well, no three marula oil this oil is so good and um maracuja oil and i'm a face oil queen let me know if y'all want to see a video on face oils because i'm no joke like i have like three or four of them out already love face oils if you're dry skin face oils will change your life i'm just saying this is so cute i should have showed y'all this but it comes with a little spatula I know the other one I dotted on, but this is actually to keep it kind of sanitary. I think I'm gonna wear a hair wrap today. It's supposed to be rainy and cold in LA. Happy spring. Y'all, I have not been rocking like a lot of foundation lately. I am gonna do a foundation declutter. I have been rocking my Makeup Forever water blend a lot. And also my Jouer. Um, I think it's the moisture tint. That stuff is so good. I don't know how I feel about this just yet. I feel like it's still too thick for my skin. Like, I don't know. I'm gonna mix some of my Laura Mercier, the bronze primer, the foundation primer and radiance bronze. And I'm gonna mix it. I don't know if I like it like this, or I know CJ was talking about taking her foundation on the back of her hair rather than like going directly in. We'll see how that works with this one. Okay, it doesn't look bad, but I don't know. Something happens throughout the day. Let's see how this works. But that looks gorgeous. 
but I did use the Radiance Bronze in it. I think maybe this is a foundation CC cream slash whatever that needs like something mixed into it. That is from Sephora, by the way. <laughs> so I could use that. There's L'Occitane at Sephora. But I don't know if you can get the Divine Line. I know that my, my comfort cream that I love so much is there. And L'Occitane is a luxury brand. So I know some of y'all are like, oh, it's extremely expensive. But I'm going to tell you something. Because the ingredients are so good, I'm, I'm just saying this. And um, especially for this brand, because I do want to come with skincare systems. A lot of times I'm going to let that dry just a little bit. Learn that from Jackie Ina. And it does work. I really like that. Thank you, girl. I need to use up my Smashbox Primal Water. I found my Master Conceal. This was in a project pad and I lost it. I tend to lose things even though I try to keep them together. Agave Lip Mask. Okay, in terms of powders to set my face on, I've been using this, y'all, to set my under eye. This is the Ambient uh, Lighting Edit, the Ambient powder, uh, powder. And, ooh, you know, recently I did a tutorial on Instagram, and I actually went in with a sponge, and it was not bad at all. It's act it was actually very, very nice. <gasps> Has this happened to y'all? Look what just happened. This is a Morphe E3. Let me know if that's happened to you guys in terms of their brushes. I've had that happen a couple of times. I should send them an email because to me that just helps them know that, hey, let me, let's address this because I think it's important. Now, I'm not talking about being like a makeup hag, you know, hey, you know, some people just, I feel like, take it out of hand. But I feel like it's important to speak up and talk about things that, you know, if you're spending your money and it's a product that is not working or if it's defective or maybe you didn't get a good product because maybe that one was just, like I said, a defective product. Or maybe the product is not good at all. Oh. By the way, speaking of products and companies, please tell me that I wasn't the only one that saw that Sephora was going to be changing their return policy. I kind of knew that, especially when you see these videos about I spent a thousand dollars on Sephora or a thousand dollar Ulta haul and then people don't keep it. Now I'm saying, you know, there's there's return and then there is I did it for the video. Something for the video. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Now we're gonna go into the tortiest spread palette. Let's see anymore. I should set this. Let's set this. We're remembering stuff. Stelazi has the good brushes too. This yes, Stelazi. I was right. Mm. Y'all. I have to give props to anybody that pans that palette, okay? Because I'm getting sick and tired of that La Rock Pro palette, okay? I'm just saying, I need some variation in my life, okay? That is creasing the ambient powder, it is not setting the powder, and they say that's not really a setting powder. I need something to set it. Y'all pretend like this is a Sephora micro screw. This is actually the mineralized skin finish but it's the same thing okay once i run out of this i am gonna get the micro smooth so you it helps you save a few dollars just a few dollars okay but i like this my sister's been talking about my posture shout out to doctor Dr. Lisa and she was just saying you know she's a doctor of physical therapy uh, she was just saying like girl your posture 
and it's true she was saying like studies have shown like you think better you feel better you have more energy your thought processes are more fluid when you're posturing when you're you know because when you tend to like breastfeed or you know when you're nursing your child you do this so i've done that so long that i have i need to like strengthen and train myself to you know have some good posture i'm not gonna do too much to my eyes because nobody's gonna be seeing me at work but sometimes i like like a little glow, glow. like a little bit I, nobody talks about this, but this is so good. The Estee Lauder Brow Now Stay in Place Brow Gel. I mean, Estee Lauder got everything stay in place. This is a good brow gel. So sometimes I will brush through my brows with this, and then I will go in and fill in. Ooh, let's put something on our lips and a little bit mascara. This, um, this is a mascara I'm trying out. It comes in a tube. It's from Mayron. Y'all, if you're a makeup artist, you know about Mayron. If you, you might know about Mayron if you're not a makeup artist, but a lot of makeup artists know about Mayron. What is going on with my bunny ears up here? good okay let's put on a lip and then we'll kind of be done this one I'm gonna go a little bit for a warm much to warm yeah let's do warm this is Smashbox driver seat Smashbox uh, always on lip lip I love this color See how I didn't even have to use a highlight? Totally would go on vacay with a look like this. This is like light eye, like hardly no eye, a little bit of mascara, and a semi bold lip. I'm just saying. Okay. So, uh, what else did I want to talk to you guys about? Oh, so Project Pan. I have a video coming, I'm gonna film right after this about. Three ways to stop wasting money like three ways how to how to stop wasting money three easy ways i think that's what i'm gonna do we're gonna wear a head wrap today done i used an infinity scarf it's gonna be rainy and cold and i actually don't want my hair out because uh, i'm gonna wear my hair out for generation beauty with my hair curly that's what i'm gonna do just think putting on some little earrings these are some silver earrings that I have and I think we're done yeah um, I think I'm going to have to mix this with things in order to like it because um, I have not I, and you know what that's been I'm gonna do a review on that because oh they rave people rave about this but this is not I'm not a fan unless I mix it with something like I like how it looks now but I feel like I had to mix it with something. You know what I'm saying? I didn't put on any blush. This is Baby Love by Too Faced. This is probably one of my favorite. I want to try some Bobbi Brown. Let me know what you like from Bobbi Brown. I've been seeing some people. I've never tried the brand. I hope you guys enjoyed this get ready with me yeah but leave your questions down below because i want to do a q a whether it's project pan whether it's about natural hair uh leave questions down below uh and yeah leave questions down below let me know what you like about if you like that cc cream and i had another question Hope you guys enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.